I think there's no space. Yeah, something like that. So is it on? Okay. Rebello versus Swiss Beats here. Swiss Beats, very young player, up and coming. Uh, uses Balrog. Uh, Rebello, as you know, Guile player. One of the top Guiles in Canada. I assume they're starting off with a, with a button check. Okay, no button check. Nice, goes in for the grab. Oh, needs a sonic boom. It's a tough match for Balrog, definitely. Um, and, until he can get Guile into the corner, it's really hard to get in damage against the uh, against Guile with good reactions, good zoning. But um, once you can get him in the corner, the, the advantage definitely shifts in your favor. Right here, very difficult, very difficult for, uh, for Guile to do anything to Balrog. Very nice display. Um, fucking up for Bello. That's good. That's, that's really what we like to see. Yeah. It really is a game of patience for Balrog, a game of, um, of waiting it out, um, trying to get into the corner. Um, from, uh, from the right range, you can, uh, you can jump over Sonic Booms um, with, uh, with an early jumping Fierce, and it'll beat out most of Guile's options, um, including that air grab. Uh, oh, wow, that was nice. I, I thought that was going to cross up myself, and solid combo. Rebello, very reliable when it comes to converting damage once he started his, uh, his hit. Um, wow, okay, went for the... Uh, Good old tap into EX headbutt. Rebello didn't fall for it. Okay, here we go. Let's see if Swizz can put a, a display like he had in the first round on again. He was facing well. Reversal. That's good. He should have focus canceled that. But, um, well, I mean, it's a bit of matchup knowledge. Maybe he didn't have before, and <laughs> now he does. Yeah. yeah very tough. Nice neutral jump. Uh, beat that EX flash kick and Guile's out of the corner again. In a position like this, it's you got to play so patient as Balrog because you don't have that much life left to play with. You can still block Sonic Booms. In the position he's in right now, he can block. Well, I mean, not that many more, but um, he does have meter over over Guile, which is something. Okay, here we go. Uh, drops the combo. That hurts. Nice tap. I guess thrown in. So Swizz not doing not doing too bad, um, but um, he's definitely gonna have to come up with something special to get past Rebello here, the uh, Canadian champion. Nice headbutt. Okay, yeah, yeah. Make your way through those booms. Uh, he's got a nice combo by Rebello again. Standing jab to reset. Nice. Getting chucked. Ops for a light punch headbutt on, on wake up. Speculative uh, decision. Uh, that back fist is such a good anti-air. Um, Guile really does have a great assortment of anti-air options. Um, but if you um, if you can just wait um, at, at the maximum range of your, uh, of your jumping fierce and just wait for uh, Guile to throw out a sonic boom, uh, you, you, you can jump in on it, and it's very difficult for Guile to counter it from that range. Um, you'll, you'll stuff his, uh, his crouching fierce to trade with it. Nice throw. Okay. Pushing him into the corner. This is exactly where he wants. Okay. Um, he's got to be a little bit more careful with those anti-airs in the future, but let's see if he can get some nice combo into Super by Rebello. Looking pretty one-sided so far. Nice autocorrect dash punch. Okay, he's got him into the other corner again. Oh, good reactions from Rebello. Very nice punish there. And that's all she wrote for Swizz Beats. Good stuff, though. Good stuff. Quickly. It's, it's definitely not, in, not an easy matchup. F. Freddy Loco e. versus Dominion on the e. screen. Freddy Loco versus Dominion on the screen. <laughs> 